This is a demonstration of the network update ability of the Neuros OSD. For more information on this product, please go to our website at www.neurostechnology.com. Now, before we plugged in the unit, we made sure that the Ethernet cable was plugged in and that we do have an internet connection. Go ahead and start up the unit. Go down to Settings, hit Enter. Go down to Firmware Upgrade, hit Enter. There's a frequency option if you'd like it to check on its own as opposed to you checking manually. We're going to leave this off. And Include Beta Updates allows the OSD to look for test builds of firmware, which might offer more features, but also might not be as stable as the normal releases. We're going to leave this on for this demonstration. Then we go down to check now, enter, and over to OK when it asks to check over the internet. And it'll, if it finds a new firmware version, it will begin to download it. If it doesn't, it'll say there's no new firmware, and then you'll simply go back to the upgrade screen. Here you can see the firmware being downloaded onto the OSD. and you will see the previous version you're going from to the newest version you're going to. The screen will flicker a bit and then the upgrading process will begin. This will probably take between 10 and 15 minutes depending on what firmware you are on. Now once you get to the end of the upgrade process, the unit will automatically restart itself and bring you up to the main Neuros menu. To check to make sure that you are on the newest firmware, go down to Settings, hit Enter, and go down to Properties, and you should see that you are on a new version of firmware.